Okay, we're outdoors now, a man that needs no introduction, Mr. Bruce Goldsmith himself. And he's going to tell us all about this wonderful glider we've all been hearing about, The Cure. Hi, Emma. Hi. <laughs> yeah, it's nice that the sun finally came out for us. Um, yeah, I've been working on this glider for the last six months, The Cure, which is a, a high C. And in fact, there seems to be a sort of new category growing, which is high C, low D together. And it's... Uh, to me, it's almost one category, you know, this, this high C, low D category. So that's what it's aimed at, so the area like a GTO, M6, Triton kind of area. And it's a classic three-liner um, with, a, with a strong shark nose, very strong. And, um, well, I'll get the glider out and then you can see some more of it. Great. So here we have the famous leading edge, which has evolved from the base. The base had a similar style design. It's uh, very unique to BGD because we have our CCB system here and then we have a little mini rib in the leading edge so we've got plastic in the middle of the cell and if you look inside you can see we've got a, a really tiny rib in the nose which um, gives the actual rigidity in the leading edge just where you need it for accelerated flight. So it, it follows a similar philosophy to the rest of the gliders with uh, less cells but putting uh, extra detail in where you, where you need to uh, give uh, better aerodynamic performance. So cleaning up the leading edge and making the leading edge um, cleaner and stiffer. And uh, what, was the, uh, what was the original idea behind um, the cord cut billow? Where did, where did that emanate from? Yeah, well, the first lighter I built with 3D panel shaping was the Magic back in 2000. But I kept it quiet for about 10 years, so it wasn't until about... Ten year, you know, about 2010, the other manufacturers started to use 3D panel shaping. And uh, I was always really unhappy about having a cut across the front of the panel just where you don't need it. Because when you cut across here and stitch it, you end up with shrinkage in the stitching. And it gives you a turbulence just where you don't need it. So it's better to have the turb uh, any cuts going across further back here. And this... 3D panel shaping was something I evolved over the last four years or so to, uh, to get over that problem so that any cuts are in the same direction as the ribs and there's no cuts cutting across the cord of the glider in the leading edge. It does lead for a very, very neat leading edge. So uh, let's see Tia try and take off. We have, we've got a little audience here. I think everybody's waiting. <laughs> How old is Tia now? How long has he been flying for? He's 17. He's been flying all his life. So you're going to turn him into one of your test pilots? Yes, he's already started <laughs> to test fly the Cure for me. So. This year he started at the beginning of the year on an ENA, then he flew the base, B, and well, then the Wasp, and then the base, and now he's on the Cure. And then the Tala, then the Tala Light, and now the Cure. So. And so uh, what else are people going to have on their uh, Christmas, uh, Christmas list? Yeah, this is another new product, which is... Um, I think a first time in the in the sport, which is really nice. Just this, a buff, you know, a neck neck scarf with the BGD logo on it. And uh, I use these a lot myself because I'm always getting you know, sensitive to the sun and I always get burnt face, burnt lips. Works better than sun cream, so I'll just stick it on. <laughs> there we go. There you go. The buff. The buff, yes. <laughs> Tell us about the other product you just mentioned. <laughs> <laughs> and we're working on a very special secret undercover product which is BGD underwear and uh, should be out in the next few weeks. <laughs> okay well Bruce thanks very much from everyone at Rock the Outdoor thank you very much we can't wait to hear about your undercover products and see it in the real for real. <laughs> thanks very much so we've been uh, we've had a rock and roll year this year with things just exploding and so let's hope next year carries on the same. Great well lots of luck with the cure. Thank you.